Hello everybody, we are going to talk about crying babies, particularly those with age less than one year of age. We are going to discuss about causes and management of babies having cry. Actually, only 20% of infants below 2 months crying require medical attention. On an average, babies cry 2 hours per day, peaking at 6 weeks of age. Small for gestational age and premature babies may be at higher risk of crying. Peak period of infant crying is in evening and early night. Excessive that is more than 2 hours crying in older children. Older children means more than 3 to 5 months may be associated with behavioral problems like anxiety, aggression, hyperactivity or decreased duration of breastfeeding or postpartum depression. Acute onset uncontrollable crying. This is most likely due to medical condition. Potentially overlooked conditions include corneal abrasion, tunicate effect of a hair wrapped around a finger or penis, occult fracture, urinary tract infection, acute abdomen including inguinal hernia or aberrant coronary artery. This requires investigation. GI distress can result following mother having cruciferous wedge diet which include cabbage, cauliflower, broccoli and like foods. Crying is part of normal neurobehavioral development. To have attention, child may give signals like change breathing and color, postural and movement changes, calm vocalization. If these phase, child may resort to crying. All these are called pre-cry cues. Management is to provide undistracted calm environment. Second is swaddling that is to tie with a cloth. Mother infant skin to skin contact and carrying child may be useful. On demand feeding will help reduce hunger related tension. Infants with excess crying beyond 4 to 6 months can have neurobehavioral dysfunction and may be at higher risk of problems of sleep, behavior and feeding. Thank you.